So, needles to say, that was the most disgusting headdress session I ever done. So as a snack, I always make sure I drink my water first, because hydration. And then make my coffee, have a piece of chocolate, which is the 85% chocolate. Before I start my day, I'm gonna go ahead and read something, write, journal. So as my morning read goes, I love to read the Confident and uh, Woman devotional. There is a devotional for every day. I'm not Christian, but um, I can reflect to what it has to say and just apply it to my own situation and life. So it's really good even if you, if you aren't Christian or any other um, religion. You still can find this uh, book helpful. And then the next one, it's like a relaxation book, I would say. It's very thin and I read it already four times. And it's really easy to read and enjoyable. Hi, baby. Luna. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, Luna. Hi. Hello. Oh, you're so cute. Oh my god. My heart is melting. Yeah. Yeah, because of you, my heart is melting. You're just beautiful. You are beautiful. Okay, mommy, let me sleep. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Um, again, <laughs> I'm out on a walk with this little nugget. I hope you guys can hear me and see me <laughs> because there's traffic and the wind is blowing. But I just realized I haven't even touched based on what my macros are, what macros I'm hitting today. So basically that's 150 grams of protein, uh, 250 carbs and 40 fat. So it has been the second week I'm doing this and then I'm on a seven low and uh, three high carb split. And before I did the same thing, so seven low, three high and my macros my high carb day macros were the same, but on low days I had 160 carbs, 150 protein and 45 fat. So they have gotten a little bit lower, but it's all good. I'm not starving. I'm not even hungry in terms of physical hunger. I feel a little weaker by the, I would say the fourth, fifth low day, but um, yeah it's part of the process actually i just talked to my coach maybe we can uh change switch to a different split uh i actually would prefer like a three low four low maybe and one high carb day but um we shall see for now this is what i got this is what i'm working with and uh as i said i have um, something fun planned for tonight hope I can make it happen <laughs> and then I show you that mm, and yeah this is probably gonna be another day in a life with full day of eating for my first meal of the day I'm having my usual oats with chocolate and banana this morning and then five egg whites with ketchup and mustard so that's my staple I eat every day the same for breakfast like 99% of the time and I just can get bored of it like comment below if you have any meal or food that you can eat every single day and you can get bored of it
say that was the most disgusting headdress session I ever done. Um, it felt terrible heavy for me. Like it was 140 kilograms, so that's about 300 pounds. I don't wanna lie. So approximately it's 308 in pounds and it was heavy as fuck seriously I'm not gonna lie so I'm gonna switch to a lighter weight and uh, do about five sets of ten reps and then just go ahead and continue with my uh, with the rest of the training that I plan for today Couple of days ago, I didn't film the one 
uh, I did today because I just wanted to like get in the zone and do my workout uh, without having to worry about hitting the right angles for the camera and stuff like that so anyway I hope you enjoyed that workout now I'm gonna have this juicy apple this one actually a pink lady not sure which one is your favorite type of apple comment below if you have one I love uh, red delicious and the pink lady that's like um, very close to the one that I found in the States. I haven't found it here in Slovakia yet. It's called the uh, Honey Crisp. I think that's the best apple in the entire world, but I haven't found it yet here. So I'm just gonna have this, go home. Actually, no, I have to stop at the post office, but then after I'm gonna go home and probably make a risotto. So. so I just got home and I was stirring. So I just threw agreements in the air fryer. I added cheese, and if you guys make cheese in the air fryer, it's life changing. Seriously. And I just sliced up some tomatoes and cucumber. So I'm gonna have this as a little snack until I'm cooking my risotto, which I will have uh, later uh, in about two three hours. So. Yeah, it may not look appetizing, but trust me, it's super delicious. So it's now, now 5 p.m. I made this risotto. I used basmati rice instead of the risotto rice because I just like it better. So there is spinach, uh, corn, green peas, and uh, carrot, and some turkey rest and I'm gonna have this one go and train my client have my coffee as well yeah and that's all that's gonna be meal number three three hours later okay so this is gonna be the before and I just mixed all the ingredients in that you've seen in a previous uh, clip and gonna bake it for about 25 minutes on 180 celsius i'm not sure what is in in fahrenheit but i'm gonna put it on the screen once i found it out guys so the cake is ready and i'm not sure what should i say but oh my god it smells so good i wish i could just Send you the smell. Guys, you ready for this? How beautiful this cake is. That's only the empty package. And I also saved some chocolate shreds so I can just put it on the top of the cake. Guys, and the macros for this is, is unbelievable. That's like a whole cake. I don't know if you can see it. And here is my hand for reference, so it's basic. The pan is the size of my hand. Oh my god. I can't wait to cut this up. I can have this whole cake tonight. Oh my god. Dream come true. Okay, I'm gonna be one of those people who are super annoying the way they cut the cake. Or you know, they're just like go in the middle of it but i can't help it i i have to see how this cake looks like okay let's go oh my gosh oops Okay, let's try it one more time. On like this little peanut here. If this is not heaven, I don't know what is. 
I'm so excited to eat this. <laughs> Let's try it on camera. Look at that piece. Okay, I wanna focus on my head, but anyways, you already guys see it. You guys have to make this. I'm gonna put the recipe in the next snap picture, whatever. You just screenshot it and promise me you're gonna make it. If you like peanuts, you like chocolate, you like, you like, you like oh my gosh, you like sneakers, you gotta make it like right now. <laughs> Hope you all enjoy this whole day of eating on high carb day and maybe you get some ideas what you can cook or make. And uh, yeah, that's gonna conclude this today's video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it, subscribe so you won't miss another video in the future. And I'll see you guys probably for my next busy cup day. Have a great week. Bye.